Yo, what's going on YouTube and welcome back to more Amiibo coverage. Once again, I am bringing you another quick unboxing so that you can sort of see these models up close and personal, see what they look like, get sort of like, you know, a gauge for the quality of them. And that way, if you're on the fence, you're not sort of sure whether or not you want to get one, then this should hopefully help you make your mind up. Now, if you're wondering what Amiibos are, then make sure you tune in tomorrow where I'll be making a separate video that will show you how they work in Super Smash Brothers. But briefly, as you can see on the back of the box or the packaging, they can appear in game, earn items, level up, and do much more. Now, the use does vary from game to game, and they do also have an application in Mario Kart 8, and any progress you do make on them is saved on the Amiibo itself. So with that out of the way, let's get into the unboxing itself and unbox Donkey Kong. Now, Donkey Kong is number four in the series in the first round of Amiibo, and he is definitely one of the best. I would definitely kind of put him up there alongside like Pikachu, Yoshi, and Mario. They are definitely my favorite ones, but Donkey Kong is a really, really solid looking model. So I said this in my other videos, but I am really impressed with the quality of all the models. They're made of a really good quality material. The paint job is done really well, and the whole sort of pose and the like character and the sort of personality you get from the model is just really, really done nicely. It's captured in such a way that it, you know really illustrates the character, and you definitely sort of get that kind of like battle pose or something that is unique to that character. This is definitely a very sort of Donkey Kong pose with this whole sort of tire flying off the side and sort of like in the middle of a jump. So yeah, this is definitely good quality. Like I said, they feel really weighty, sturdy. They're made of a really good quality plastic, and just sort of like, you know the coloring and everything around them is just really, really good. Aside from that, there's not really much else I need to say. Hopefully the footage is sort of like spoken for itself and you know you can actually sort of like get a gauge on whether or not you actually like the quality of the model, but this should at least kind of illustrate up close and personal what they really do look like. And that is pretty much it for this video. As promised, it was only going to be really quick. I've got videos for each of the different amiibos going up, so if you haven't seen one or there's one in particular you want to see, then I will leave a link to the playlist in the description box down below so you can check it out. Otherwise, as always, if you did enjoy this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, hit the like button and show your support. It does really help me out and obviously don't forget to subscribe for daily gaming videos and much more Smash Bros and Amiibo coverage. Drop a comment down below and let me know if you picked up any Amiibo and if you did, which ones did you get? And thanks again for watching. Take it easy. Catch you next time. Peace out.